today I'll be reviewing the sunscreen which you have already guessed by now is the La Shield Fiasco sunscreen gel and it is a fragrance free sunscreen and it contains 25% micro ionized zinc oxide. Before starting off I want to stress on the fact that the sunscreen is the most important thing you can apply. I mean please never ever skip your sunscreen. I am in my 30s and you can clearly see that sunscreen is the one thing which I have never skipped throughout my life. I mean since my teenage years I have religiously used a sunscreen and I'm blessed that my parents have always stressed on the importance of sunscreen if you have been following me you already know that I have shifted to mineral sunscreens long back there are many advantages of using a mineral sunscreen over a chemical one Z block and 360 block are two such sunscreens which contain zinc oxide and titanium dioxide however the La Shield one contains zinc oxide and has no perfume added now the Z block contains perfume as one of its ingredient list however the 360 block doesn't have perfume but the 360 block sunscreen is a bit costly than the other two so yeah i will list out the difference between a mineral sunscreen and a chemical sunscreen on the screen for your reference and i would absolutely recommend you all to shift to a mineral one I want to also stress about the fact of the presence of silicones in all of the sunscreens. Now basically all of this sunscreen contains silicone in their ingredient list and it does help to get a very smoother finish onto your skin. Now I am here comparing the consistency of the Z-Block sunscreen, the 360 degree sunscreen and the La Shield sunscreen. Now when I tested it obviously I felt the presence of more silicones on the Z block and 360 degree one because it feels a bit of kind of uh, a silicone finish. Mm -hmm. However mm -hmm. on the La Shield one I felt there is a less presence of silicone. However it is a bit heavier on the heavier side I felt that because it is like more suitable for the dry and combination skin. This is produced by Glenmark Pharmaceuticals and if you compare three of them, each of them contains 50 gram or 50 milliliter of the product and each of them is chemical free and water resistant for up to certain hours. But the price of the Lashiel one is lesser than that of Z-Block. Uh, personally speaking, Z-Block is what I would prefer even though it contains perfume. Uh, I like Z-Block more for oily skin and acne prone skin type. And this is how my face looks after application. I am showing you the procedure. Now as all of this sunscreen actually contains zinc oxide or titanium dioxide it does leave a white cast onto your face but it eventually goes off and moreover it gives a smoother finish. Most of the good suggestions actually come from you all so I will highly recommend you to comment down below if you have any suggestions to try out and yeah that was all about today's video I hope it was useful in some or the other way and see you in my next one till then bye bye take care